Good afternoon, it's Jamie with Comox Valley Hyundai. And this afternoon I'm featuring the sought after 2023 Kona EV. Now this one's the preferred model. It is ever growing, increasing in popularity for us. Uh, great looking vehicle and uh, certainly been in high demand for us. The 2023s have started to roll in and I uh, thought I'd do a quick walk around video for anyone interested in further details to get a, a closer look as they're not always uh, on our lot. So quick look on the outside, much like the gas Kona, but uh, some nice similarities, uh, uh, but differences in lines. Of course, across the front, uh, there's no grill. And uh, just gonna open up to let you have a look there. There's a charge port that's at the front of the vehicle. And there are plugs there for, you can do a level one charger, uh, which is a regular plug-in, a level two charger, which a lot of people ins install at their home, and a fast charger level three, where both of those plugs would come out, uh, where you can get up to 80% in under an hour. Let's have a quick look inside here. Well, actually, we'll go around the back first here, open up the hatch. Plenty of storage. Of course, this will pop out. Those back seats will fold down. Just gonna have a look underneath here. There we've got an air kit uh, in lieu of a spare tire as well as a charging cord. Uh, again, walking, locking wheel nuts on this one here. We'll just have a look inside. So again, plenty of room in this one. I'm, uh, I'm six foot four and lots of headroom, plenty of room to drive. Just started it up there. Of course, we've got the digital digital screen. And new for 2023, the preferred model comes with a larger screen uh, with built-in navigation. Have a look there. Of course, the screen plays a part with the electric vehicle, lots to look at. Information about the electric vehicle there, battery charge. Uh, questions that do come with this one is around range, of course. Um, the built-in uh, official government range number is 415 kilometers. Uh, here on the island in the summer, we've had customers telling us we're getting north of 500 kilometers. And with our milder winters, uh, you might be a, sh a shade under 400, but not too, not too bad there. Again, push button transmission. So uh, these things drive like a little rocket, um, no gearing, no lag with gas. Uh, so very fast off the line. Uh, and here you can see Again, with our lower trim model, we've got heated seats, heated steering wheel, drive modes, uh, plenty of options here. Uh, lots of safety features as well. We've got blind spot warning. Uh, we've got lane departure control, uh, lane follow assist, adaptive cruise control. Uh, here you see the steering wheel mounted controls. Uh, of course, Bluetooth. Um, you've also got Apple CarPlay, Android Auto. Uh, again, lots of, you know, an endless number of features to look at here. You see quite the, the screen with lots of menu there. So a ton of technology. Uh, the MSRP on these, uh, this is the preferred model, is just over 46,000. So by the time you add your tax and subtract the up to $9,000 in government rebates, you could be in the low 40s for a fully electric SUV. So anyway, if you have any further questions, uh, I'm happy to chat about the Kona EV. Again, my name is Jamie. You can give me a shout here at 250 465-1634.